The boil. Big boil coming up there. I just dropped a really nice barra. I'm going to get us away from here a little bit, buddy, so we're not sitting on them, okay? Hey! Tarpon from hell. God, Jesus. Oh. Yeah, he's got a mark on him. Get out. Yeah, that's the one that hit me, you bastard. <laughs> <laughs> nice fish, mate. Hmm. Oh, what did you spit up? Uh -huh. oh. Baby bear, is it? No, it looks like a Moses. Hmm. No, yeah, it's a Moses. It's got teeth. Hmm. Yeah. Or. Legal size jack, but we don't want any more fish to eat. <laughs> you want to jump back in? Oi, something just chased. Little croc there. Oh wow. It's no a little salty, about three foot long. No. Pigs? Sounds like pigs. Oh, big jack and then a GT or something chasing it. Little croc sitting right on the edge there, just cast near him. That's him. Go, little fella. Oh, well, look at all the fish in there. Mm, look at the pikeys. They look like that. Pikeys are. No, a couple of them were jacks. Oh, oh I've seen that. That's a jack. Off one, um, stick in the <laughs> The lure is on the rug tip. <laughs> I'll drop one too in there. I don't know if it was a jack though. That's a little baby red one. Mm. Nice little, little baby. A little follow. You smacked it hard though. Yeah. Mm. Big black spot, big fat guts on it. Doesn't seem to be anything up in here. Like when they're in here, yeah. yeah, yeah. Not a bad one. About three and a half. Two massive crocs, one just slid in just here, and another one slid in just there. This one here, we recognize, we know him pretty well, he's pretty easily identified. But again, really, really weird shit because like it's two big crocs together. That's not supposed to happen. And that's the second time we've seen that in, what, two or three weeks. Mm. Oh. Boil? Oh yeah, oh. yeah. Oh. oh, what is it? Oh, you're I on. Got it. Oh, Oh, really? Mm. Oh, fuck, there's yeah. another one. I don't want that one. Oh, he, he got my line up. Oh, he These are different. Hmm? These are different ones. No, it's a GT. Yeah, it is. Hmm. Oh, Red, isn't he? Good That's one. a good fish, yeah. Oh, no, he's not. He no. yeah. looks way bigger. He did. 
Yeah. yeah. No, it's a barrel. Hang on for two seconds, babe. Okay. I just gotta get this fish off here. Ow. Oh, oh Jesus. No, that's all barish. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nah, he'd be lucky to be legal. But GT. Oh, oh. <laughs> Drop your lure in there. No. Do it. Alright, no. Do it. No, Do it. I'm Do not it. for jacks. I don't want it. Who's a big better one? Oh, see? I was looking at my reel. Red, big red jack. 50? No. 40? Oh! Oh, that one. No, that was another one. Oh, I'm wrapped around my rod tip. I'm going to spot this. lock it. I can do this. It's my time to shine. That might have been a different one. Yeah, there's more than one on there. No, that might be it. We're going for that one. Oh, did you? Yeah, I got all of that. I got both of them ones on the surface. Oh. Oh. <laughs> as soon as it gets down deeper. Yeah, exactly. Right. Is that for a jack? That one might be a photo fish. It's a proper photo fish, that one, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, it wouldn't even be legal. Geez, he came out bright red, though, didn't he? Hey. What? Kingfish is trying to eat my mirror. GT. Oh, a heap of them. There we go. Oh, bloody croc just jumped in off the bank up behind these. Must be sunny patches in behind there, eh? Mm. Wasn't a big one, but. I thought it was a pikey. No, a little jag. <laughs> wow, look how far he set that hook up. Mm. Up near his eye. He or you? Well, it technically is better than every fish though, isn't it? Like, because all fish eat, like... Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I was just about to adjust the bloody electric. He's not quite legal. Right, right down deep too he was. Whip tail. Hmm. I'm gonna trim off like that back taily part. Hmm. I wouldn't so. Oh no, never mind, doesn't even matter. I've got that in there now. No. Oh. Mm. Where am I, which way am I going? This feels like a jack. <sighs> yes it is. Oh dang it. No, uh, no it's a bloody grunter. What? Oh, okay. Lucky I have this lure on then. Spotted? Yep. <laughs> oh, spiky one. Grunner's always spiky. Right? I know, they are the worst fish for spiking. But he was right on the bottom. I can't do anything. <laughs> yeah, he is. <clears throat> I'm going to need the net, mate. How am I to do it? Free, <laughs> free spill. Here, oh, hold your rod. You grab that net. 
Thank you. Oh god, oh, he's got a black tail. Mm. Tough. Oh, he's not a bad one. He's fat. Mm. Mm-hmm. Little croc slide there with the mud coming off it. Mm. Oh, one just went in. Yep. And this one we get fishing too. Mm. Oh, hear that down there? I heard something. Yeah, nice. oh. What was that? Oh. What the hell is that? Something chasing Dunno. those those mullet. It's got to be a bull shark, isn't it? Always take it up. Oh dear. I was getting my lure off a of bloody snag, and Tanum dropped in next to the snag while I'm poking the lure off me with my rod tip, which, by the way, you're not supposed to do. And Buff had bloody pulled a, that jack there, which is probably the one that hit my lure. <laughs> the one that... Oh, what the hell? They're GTs after yeah, it. Jack one I don't, there, I don't want jack. a GT. No, they were, they, they were definitely GTs. <coughs> He's a nice jack, man. I think I got that on. Um, yeah. Pretty well. good. Barramundi. A little follow. I can't believe all the GTs chasing that bloody jacket. Yeah, there was like four or five of them. Mm. Up there too. You got it? Yep. <laughs> Look at them all. Yep. Well, you just play with them. I'm just going to take us down oh, here. Jesus. <laughs> yep, you're just up there. You can crop this one along the edge of the bank. Same one there. Another crop. See in there? Oh yeah, yep. Yep, two little ones. Yeah. That for a friggin' tarpon. My God. Get a little poo out of you. Mm, that was the biggest tarpon I've seen for a long time. Boy, Jack. Never mind. Oh, and again. get dinner ready. We're doing a rump roast in the camp oven. This is one of Jamie's from uh, Rising Sun Meats. One of his rump roasts. We did one the other day and absolutely beautiful. So this is going to get turned into in a couple of hours something pretty special. All you gotta do here salt pepper so that's pretty much it. She's covered in a bit of Italian herbs 100% Australian Hoits and from salt. Australian but Italian. Hoits, yep, Italian flavour. Uh -huh. um, and then we've got some salt and pepper all over. Now I'm just going to go and heat the um, barbecue plate up. I'm going to sear it on all sides and I'll show you what we do there. All right, so I'm going to bring the camp oven there. It'll heat up pretty quick. So we're going to sear him on all sides. So when I say sear it, I mean it's got to be really hot and um, just sear it so that it seals the meat, like that. That one. If you can get a hold of one, I don't know where they where you can get a hold of them now, but these hillbilly camp ovens are the best. They, they're made out of spun steel, and that thing's been used a hell of a lot of times, and it just keeps on going, but they're lightweight. They're not... Your traditional 
It's not your traditional um, camp oven, cast iron, but they're good. So that's the, that's the coals. So before you do get a couple of shovelfuls of coals on that, chuck her on the lid. Come back in about an hour and a half. Thirty-nine forty. Get that bloody hook out of his mouth. Oh, oh, he tried to bite me. Okay. Right. Fighting so. like a jack. Yeah, yeah nice big red one. Good one, mate. He's a good one. Nice solid jet. Mm. Yeah. 